Police found Nassim Ogdam asleep in her car at 1.38 a.m., hundreds of miles from home the day of the shooting. Are you ever planning on going back home? No? <laughs> okay, fair enough. Do you have any friends or anybody out here? No? Officers discovering the 38-year-old had been reported missing by family. You don't want to hurt yourself, do you? Oh, you don't want to hurt anybody else? You don't want to commit suicide or anything like that, right? Okay. The parking lot encounter came 30 miles away from YouTube, where Ogdom opened fire 11 hours later. We have a report of subject with a gun. Ogdom seriously wounded three employees, then took her own life. The shooter's family says the prolific YouTube user lost her income after the company changed how it pays its users. Why Mountain View? I mean, I know it's a great city and everything, but... <laughs> Oh, okay. The suspect's family says they told authorities Ogdom could be a threat. The parents warned police, be careful, maybe you should anger up YouTube. Police say they followed up and her father never said she was dangerous. Is there anything you want us to tell your parents? Okay. Hours later, gunfire erupted. Miguel Almaguer, NBC News. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.